what's going on my name is Lauren and welcome back to my channel this week's video is super exciting because I have a special co-host joining me Kat come on over come on her name is Kat I feel like I've never formally introduced her before and it needed to happen so Kat C-A-T capital C inspired by breakfast at Tiffany's she is a beautiful white fluffy cat that I actually found behind a trash can when she was like a week old, like I literally saved her life. Almost killed her though, because she was my first cat and I didn't know how to properly feed a kitten. So anyways, I'm kind of getting off track. This is my co-host for today's video. Cat, say hello. She's so beautiful, like honestly, she's perfect. I can make an entire video about her. If, if y'all want that, just let me know actually. I can I could definitely do that for you. I parted my hair down the middle today. What do you guys think about that? I feel like it's a vibe, you know? I don't know. I don't know. I changed up the game a little bit and I'm kind of loving it. Let me know though if I look insane and I should never do this again. Thanks. Love you guys. Today's video, we are going to be showing you what I got at the thrift store. I went to two different Goodwills and I got a bunch of things that I'm gonna wear for this fall. So I wanted to show you guys what I got and give you an idea of what I'm gonna do style-wise for it. Lately, I have been so into sustainable and secondhand clothing options. So this was really fun for me to do. And I feel like, honestly, I should have vlogged it. Do you guys wanna see that? Do you guys wanna see me going to the thrift stores and actually finding the pieces? Or do you prefer me just doing all the dirty work on my own and then, you know, like now, showing you everything afterwards? Because what I actually did is I cut up some of the shirts I got as well. And I honestly feel like I should have showed you guys that. I asked my mom. <laughs> And she told me that like that part was probably not that important, but I'm probably gonna do this again for sure in my life So if you guys want to see that part, let me know and I will definitely show you how I cut them and How I found them because see the reason I thought that it was a good idea is because I felt like You don't you don't find them like this You know, this is not what they look like at first and you're gonna not be looking for this when you're at their store, you know what I'm saying? So you're not gonna know what to look for. And I just feel like it would be better to see what I found them like and what I created out of them. I already found all the shirts. I already cut them all up. I already did everything I'm gonna do. So you guys just get to see like the finished product basically. But like I said, this is definitely not gonna be the last time I do this. So let me know if you guys wanna see the process itself and I will happily show that to you as well. Might have gone a little overboard, but it was my first time thrift shopping in a really long time and I just like, I, I had the urge, like I was craving it. So went a little crazy, but overall I only spent around I think it was like $60 total for all of these things. And I literally got pretty much my entire fall wardrobe. So if you want to see the things I got when I was thrift shopping, then keep watching. Short intermission to look at Kat because she's really freaking cute. Hi, Kat. Hi, Mama. So this is the first thing that I got. Is this little shirt. It's a really casual one. I don't know if you can tell the material is almost like a washcloth material and it has these three little buttons here. Actually, oh shoot, it's missing a button. I just realized that. Well, there's two of them, but it's fine because the third one would stay off anyways. The sleeves are what make it so cute. To get the sleeves like this, all you have to do is get like a 3X. Literally, that's the size of this shirt. It's a 3X. When I put it on originally, my mom was like, that is huge, Lauren. What are you doing? Kat wanted to be in the shot. I don't know. But um, yeah, she was like, this is huge. And I was like, trust me on this. Once I crop it, it's gonna be so freaking cute. So I would wear this with like some white sweatpants, just like, you know, normal sweatpants. And honestly, like a cute little purse. I just feel like this is such a vibe. And my white Air Force is just for like a clean base. Crop it and it becomes a super cute crop. I feel like I would totally see something like this at like, Princess Polly or something. Just the fit of it is like really nice. I love it so much. So yeah, this is the first thing I got. 
I wanted to show you guys what it looked like first without the style, but I just think the purse like really, really like, like just like puts the cherry on top of this look. I love it, I love it with this purse. This purse was actually my purse when I was a little girl and my mom had been saving it for me so I just got it back now that I am I guess an adult. I love this shirt. I would love to go to like Trader Joe's or like, I don't know, Whole Foods and like go sh like grocery shopping healthy with this shirt. Like this shirt makes me want to do healthy things. I don't know, I just love it. Yes, check. First one, moving on. This is the second one I got. Again, super big shirt. Just cut it. I decided I was gonna do all the casual fits first and then move on to the fancier ones. So, second casual shirt. Love this. I love how long the sleeves are. If the sleeves are technically supposed to be short sleeves but go down to your forearms, buy the shirt. Like literally, that is, did you hear me? Did I clap too loud? Buy the shirt buy it, <laughs> you need to get it. I love the fitting of this shirt. I love the fabric, the way it falls off the sleeves is really cute. And I think I would wear, you know, a similar situation to the last outfit, like some white sweatpants with my white Air Forces and maybe a little, you know, baseball tee as well, just to give it a little something, something. But um, yeah, this is the second one I got. Cat's running around, she's playing, she's having a good time. She loves it. There you go, I probably should have done that so you could see the shirt more clearly. Um, yeah, this one also has buttons, like little buttons. It's grayish and yeah. Again, this shirt was probably like down to my knees and I cut it. That's why I felt like maybe y'all would wanna see that. Insert clip, I forgot I have a clip. Insert clip. Okay, so I actually forgot to tell y'all that something I'm gonna do with the leftover fabric is create masks out of that so it matches your outfit perfectly. And that's something I really wanted to talk about but completely forgot. Here's the third one I got and this one is just like a big long sleeve t-shirt. Just like, you know, a little casual t-shirt dress. I'm kind of like edgy, I'm kind of lazy. And then I thought with this one, I could just do my Prada dupe because unfortunately, I'm not quite balling like that yet. But, I don't know, I just think that looks really cute. Cute little style, easy situation, very, you know, just sporty chic. It's a 2007 Champions thing. I don't even know. I don't watch any of those, but it's really cute. So, you know, repping. Okay, so I got a couple different flannels and cover-ups. This is the first one. I just put this shirt on to show you them, but um, this wasn't thrifted. This was from Urban Outfitters, but this was, the flannel was. Good little fall staple with the colors that it has. It's like a little olive green, a little orange, a little black. I love it, I think it's so cute. So this is the next flannel I found and this one is literally like a shacket. Like it's so thick and warm and this was such a good find. I love it so much. Nice, pretty, neutral tones, matches with everything. Literally, oh, I'm so happy with this. I kept the same stuff on because, I mean, I just wanna show you guys the different cover-ups that I got. Seriously love this, you guys. This is, oh, yes, like this is everything. Honestly, this is my first time trying all this stuff on. I just saw it and I just knew it was gonna be a move, but you guys are trying it all on with me for the first time right now, so that's pretty cool at least. But um, except for the shirts that I cut, those I had already tried on because I had to try them on to cut them, but this stuff I haven't tried on yet, so. Love it. Check. This is the next one I got, and this is a really nice, just like military green kind of cover up. I thought this would just 
be a good staple item just to wear with pretty much anything. I feel like this color goes with literally everything. And I got one just like this in beige as well. So I'm really, really happy with the way these look. Nice little beige buttons. It just gives me like a military vibe overall. I like it a lot. It looks like a little jacket, nice and oversized. So yeah, this is the fifth thing that I thrifted. All right, you guys, get ready to throw up. I feel like not a lot of people say that, but whenever I'm super duper excited, I'm like, okay, I'm about to throw up. Like I just, I've always said that if you know me, like I said that since middle school. So like, if I say that, that's what I mean. I'm just really excited. Get ready to throw up, for real. Because look how freaking cute this is, you guys. Okay, so it's a little sweater. I, I guess I'll show you the sweater first. So super cute, almost like a dad sweater. Like that's what I think of when I see this, but super cute with um, a little white collared shirt underneath. And it's oversized, so you can wear it like as a little dress. And I put some little black heels on just to make it a little fancier. You can wear this with some white Air Forces as well. But I thought this was such a cute, girly, little bit fancier look. So we're going into the fancier looks now. We're kind of leaving the casualness behind. But I just thought this was such a cute little schoolgirl look. And I knew, I knew, I envisioned it in my mind. And I knew it was going to be cute. But this is my first time trying it on. And you guys, that's with it. I literally love it. Like I, oh, and it's so comfortable. Okay, this look needs to be shot. This look needs to be shot. This look is going on the thumbnail. You know what I mean? You know, sometimes you just see the look and you just know. Like this is, this is everything. And yeah, I paired it with this little mini backpack, obviously, just to give it more of a complete look and you guys can totally get the full vibe, but. So this is the, I honestly have no idea what number we're on, but I'll figure it out when I'm editing and I'll put it on the screen somewhere maybe, or maybe not, maybe you guys don't even care. Maybe we're just like having fun now. Maybe we're just like looking at clothes, you know what I mean? All right, so this is the next thing that I thrifted, which is just like a brown, like a chocolate brown corduroy cover up. And this could be worn with casual things as well, but I decided to wait and show you this with the fancy fits because I feel like this is just such a vibe. With the all-weight Air Forces, baggy jeans, a little black, cropped, form-fitted turtleneck situation, and then the big chocolate brown corduroy cover-up. I just think this is so freaking cute. I can totally visualize myself like running errands in this. It's so comfy and oh, I just love it. I think this was such a good find. I'm so happy with it. Then I got this beige, really loose oversized blazer. Kept the same stuff on to show you this one. It's such a nice material. First of all, I really like that it doesn't have the shoulder pads. So it looks really just form fitting and like falls off the shoulders really nicely. And then I love the texture of it. It's very flowy and just so nice and like lightweight and I just love it. I've been looking for a really nice oversized blazer for a while now and I feel like this one's so cute and casual, super neutral. That's something I'm really proud of actually, is I managed to keep all of my clothing that I thrifted in like a very neutral tone range. I didn't get anything crazy toned. I kept everything very fall, very neutral, very versatile. And that was something that I really, really wanted to focus on so that I could just mix and match with so many different things. Cause this obviously can be worn with so many different things and that's what I wanted. And that's what I did. I'm so proud of myself. Here's the next one that I got. And this one was literally just like a polo shirt, like a big polo shirt. And I cropped it into a little crop situation. This is something like I know for a fact I can see on like Princess Polly or something. I don't know. I just, I feel like I've literally seen a shirt like this. And I love how long the sleeves are. Again, they go down to like the forearms, which is the length. And I paired it with another little purse from my childhood, you guys, with this chocolate brown coach purse. So I just thought that this was a vibe. 
nice little, let's go to the park. I don't know why I always wanna go grocery shopping, but all these outfits make me wanna go grocery shopping, but I love grocery shopping, so I guess it's just like, that's what I do for fun. But yeah, you could have a lot of fun in this outfit. It's super cute, super casual. Love the way it falls off the shoulder and it keeps you like really slim, even though it's a big shirt. You know, it's I, it's uh, it was a big shirt. I cut it into a crop, so it's not that big anymore, but it was at first a big shirt but it makes you look really slim because the material is super thin and like lightweight. So it's not like a regular polo shirt in the sense that it doesn't have like those wrinkly, like it's not like a wrinkly material. You know what I mean? Like it's a very thin, lightweight material. So it, it falls really nicely because of that. And I actually got a few of these collared shirts and cut them. I just kind of, overdid it a little. I saw these on Depop and I really wanted one. So when I saw them at the thrift, I was like, oh my God, I need them all. So I got like four, but two of them are long sleeve and two of them are short sleeve. So at least there's that. So I warned you, they're pretty much the same shirt, but this one has little patches on it. So it has like these checkers and it has like a light, light blue and black little checkers. So it looks super cute. Overall, it's just like a light beige color. So it's really neutral toned, paired it with yet another childhood purse. I know, I'm just like this purse gal now. But that's like what my outfits were missing, is purses, I feel. So I'm really excited, because I feel like now I'm really stunned, you know? Anyways, this is the next one, pretty much the same as the last. Here's one of the long sleeve ones. And this one's like a purpley color with lines on it. So it's textured right here, like all over. It's all over textured. But I thought this was a really cute like fall Thanksgiving kind of vibe. So again, love how long the sleeves are. This one was actually a 3X, so this one was huge. All of these shirts were either a large, an extra large, a 2X or a 3X. They were all really big but I cut them obviously, so this one was cropped as well. This one in particular, I was, I literally had to cut it basically right under the armpits. <laughs> like it was really big, but I love the fitting of it. So this is the next one. This is the last thing I thrifted, which was this little shirt, just like the last one, long sleeve, nice and big, cropped it. And this is a navy color with like white lines and it has like a little texture on it. I seriously loved this one with the white baseball cap. I think this is such a cute little like, I don't know. I just look like a, like take me to the ball game already. You know what I mean? Like this is just such a cutie. I literally love this one. And of course I kept the same jeans and white Air Forces on. So this is just, Yes, you know what I mean? Do you see why I couldn't pick? Do you see how they're kind of different even though they're the same? I don't know. That's why I felt like I had to show you them kind of styled as well because I feel like if I just showed you all those collared shirts, you'd be like, why did you get four collared shirts, you know? But now you get it, you get it, you know what I'm saying? Some of them are a little sporty, some are a little more like, I'm going to Thanksgiving dinner with my family, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, I don't know. You get what you get, you know? All right, you guys, well, that's everything I thrifted. I really hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, and I will see you next time. Kat wants to say goodbye as well. Say goodbye, mama. Like and subscribe.